Are you working as a receptionist, a file clerk, a legal assistant, some type of assistant, and you're working at a law firm or some other organization and you're wondering, how the heck am I going to get promoted? I want to get promoted to a paralegal position. I've got my paralegal certificate. I want to get started. Well, hi, I'm Ann Pearson, founder of the Paralegal Bootcamp, and I'm going to give you that answer in this video. So this video is actually going to be a replay of me answering that question inside one of our litigation bootcamp coaching calls. So inside the litigation bootcamp, I meet with the group, whoever's enrolled in the course, um, once a month. And they ask me lots of questions. We have lots of questions that we go through. And they're not always about specific things inside the course. Sometimes they're career-oriented questions like this one. So stick around and I'm going to answer the question, how do I get promoted from a receptionist to a paralegal position? I'm ready to start my paralegal career. I'm a receptionist taking this course because I couldn't get a paralegal job after graduating with my bachelor's in legal studies. How can I prove to my law firm what I've learned in the course to get a promotion to a paralegal position? Ah, so first tell them, whoever it is, whoever you need to tell, you need to tell them first of all, that you took the course. If they have any questions about what's in the course, I can give you a PDF of the course brochure that breaks down what's in each module. Um, tell them what you've learned is most important. So first you got to tell somebody, don't just take it and then think that they're just going to know that you know how to manage cases. So tell them. And then I probably said this, if I didn't say it in the course, I'm saying it now, what I've learned throughout the years with attorneys is that you have to show them. You can't just like, you can tell them, I took this course. I got this certificate. That's, I would tell that to the HR person, whoever's in charge of your paralegals. I would let them know if it's a paralegal manager, then go talk to them. Even though you're the receptionist, just ask if you can have an appointment with them and tell them what you've completed in the course. So first tell that person, then show the attorneys what you can do. But what I thought was really interesting is that this question came in at a time where just last week I was doing a pre-interview for my podcast and it's a uh, paralegal manager. Actually, she's the director of paralegals firmwide, huge firm. She, when she was a paralegal manager, she purchased the e-discovery bootcamp for all of her paralegals to take. So we've known each other. And that was like 2014 when I first put out the e-discovery bootcamp and we've known each other throughout the years. Well, she's moved up from, from that position to now be the director firm wide internationally, you know, has like two or 300 paralegals under her. And what I found was interesting. The reason why I'm going to have her on the podcast is she started out at the law firm as a part-time receptionist at night, not even during the day. Like, they had different shifts because I guess they would just keep the office open late or whatever. But so while she was getting her college degree with a one year old child, she was working part time at night in this law firm. She went from that in, I believe she said 1999, may have been 92, but I think it was because I started in 92 and I'm pretty sure she it was after that. So we're talking in that short of a time, she went from that to the director. And so I asked her, how did you transition? Like, how did you get the paralegal position? You know? And she said, when I finished my certificate program, I asked, I asked them and I said, I am capable of doing this job and I want a paralegal position in this firm. And then the same thing, when she went from a paralegal to a paralegal manager position, she did the same exact thing. The position came available and she asked. Now, that being said, obviously she was doing a really good job and whatever position that she was in, but some of it is you just have to ask. 